Good afternoon, happy Saturday to all of your sunshiny faces, guys. I forgot that, um, well I didn't forget, I didn't know that my dad didn't have to work today so we didn't end up going to the grocery stores. And I'll be honest guys, I just like don't feel like doing a full list this week and going to the other grocery stores. Um, this, like I told you guys too this week, I've just been so out of it, like my stomach has been so upset. Um, and like, even like right now, my stomach still feels a little upset. Like, I honestly have felt fine, like, other than my stomach bothering me. I'm kind of wondering if it was like, like a stomach bug and like, that's literally it. Um, or like, really like what it was or has been, um, you know, over the last while. Um, pretty much most of this week. Like, and it's been on and off though, because like, what was it, on thursday maybe or something like that like i felt fine and it like didn't bother me at all but like yesterday and then just now up until all day today up until just now um it's been kind of bugging me too so i don't really know what it is but um yeah guys i woke up kind of sort of late today anyway too and so that's why i was like you know what let's just tomorrow let's just just go to aldi um my dad actually ended up going to menard so we didn't have to we won't have to go tomorrow um he actually went with jack and they went and got their hair cut and they went and ran out to like target or something i don't know they went somewhere else too um because jack wanted to go get something why we are gonna go to the stores tomorrow because again though i didn't make my list ahead of time only because um I, my dad has been working the last three two two or three saturdays or something like that so i was like oh he's probably working again this week and he wasn't and i was like oh well okay then and i didn't just didn't feel like making my list today so i was like you know what? i'll skip it and just go to aldi this week um which is what i did last week too because the whole skunk situation which luckily guys we've not had another skunk situation since we fixed all those bricks and you know put the stones and stuff like that in the yard so hopefully it has been deterred my mom also found like a natural like skunk repellent where you can use like grapefruit or like citrus essential oils um and like kind of put them like sprinkle them around the yard or like where the skunk seems like it's coming in to like deter it from wanting to come into the yard um and that it will kind of help repel them which must kind of hopefully be working because they haven't we haven't had another skunk in the yard that we've seen um or that has obviously the dogs have seen and gotten sprayed by yet which is a good thing so um but i don't know like how long it's supposed to last because like you know it's rained almost like most of the week this week there's at least been a few days this week where it was raining um so i don't really know how long that's been working out um and i don't don't really know what it's attracted to like what in our yard makes it so attractive that it was there twice like you know and so it must have like maybe babies or like it has some type of other like nest or burrow i don't really even know how skunks sleep do they sleep in like burrows like they don't sleep in trees <laughs> or like bushes or anything like that but like does it have like i think they sleep in like holes like they're burrowing creatures um kind of like a like what are those other kind of like i'm cu curious where raccoons sleep like I know they come out at night and they sleep in like, or they don't sleep in trash cans, but they get into trash cans at night. But I'm like curious as to like, where does a raccoon sleep at night? Do they sleep in trees? Cause they can climb. Like, do they sleep in bushes? Do they sleep in like, I don't know. Like where are they during the day when they're not getting into trash cans at night? Um, it's kind of the same thing too with like skunks. But I think skunks, like I said, are more like they'll sleep in a hole or like a burrow or something like that because that kind of seems like their their mo <laughs> um just like you know what's the other like a badger like that's kind of they remind me of a badger and a badger sleeps in like a hole or like you know a um what was it called like a, a burrow i think i don't really know either um <laughs> anyways so i think wherever it is it's home is somewhere near here um and that's why it's been found in our yard now twice earlier this week you know like last over last weekend and then monday or tuesday or whatever it was of last week um i think it was monday and so yeah <laughs> that's why guys i am uh happy that we don't have we haven't had another skunk problem but um guys my voice can you guys tell my voice is still a little gone from yesterday which is so weird i have 
not yelled at a football game. I have not had a reason to yell at a football game in like the last two years. And finally, like just yesterday's game, I have like hardly have a voice left, which is kind of like, I don't know. I don't want to say like, oh, it's fun or cool, but like I had a reason to, which is a good thing. Um, so it wasn't just like I was like, oh, like, you know, it wasn't a very intense game. So I wasn't yelling or cheering for the team or whatever. Like it was pretty intense. So I lo almost lost part of my voice. Like it still sounds a little groggly, gravelly kind of to me um, today. But I literally spent most of the day, I was watching watching the NIU game, um, which I actually turned off at the end of like the third quarter because I was like, this is kind of a blowout. And I was watching the Notre Dame game, which it was like a blowout the other way, like Notre Dame was like crushing whoever they were playing. Um, I think it was like University of New Mexico maybe or something like that. Um, and, or else that was who NIU was playing, I can't remember. Um, but they ended up winning, I think like, 44 or something like that to like I don't even know maybe a touchdown or two or something I don't really even remember all I know is it was like a complete and utter blowout and they ended up winning but NIU ended up losing and so I ended up turning that game off which was the one that was on like later tonight like seven o'clock and um the Notre Dame game was on earlier and so was the Northwestern game and the Cubs game too which was also a really good game they ended up I don't know what the final score was. I know yesterday though, I think the final was like 17 to 8 yesterday in the Cubs game, which was like a season high for like the most runs they'd scored so far that season um, in like a single game. And I was like, wow, that's pretty crazy. Which I got to see the beginning of it in the first inning, it was like 5 to 4, I think, or something like that. After just the first inning, I was like, this is either going to be a really high scoring game or after this inning, we're not going to score any more runs and this is how it's going to end. Um, but no, I was, then we went to the Jacks football game yesterday, so I kept looking it up on my phone, and I was like, oh my gosh, how is this game still going? Like, we were, I think, halfway through Jacks game, and it was only still in, like, the sixth inning. They must have been getting through the lineup, like, just, like, 12 times <laughs> during the game or something like that, because they just, like, like, the game seemed like it was going on forever, and obviously when you're scoring, like, 17 runs, you're probably going through a lot, you know, and it's going to be taking a lot longer, too, and the other team scored eight runs, like, that's also pretty crazy, but it was, like, like, home run, and then there was, like, you know, like, somebody get a triple, and there would be, like, another home run, I think right before I left, too, somebody got, like, a grand slam, I was like, holy cow, this is crazy, um, so yeah, but I didn't get to see that whole game yesterday. And then today, I think it was still like a decently high scoring game. Like I think we had maybe eight or something like that. Um, or seven or eight maybe was the final score or something. Um, but it was still a pretty good game too. So I did edit a vlog. Um, I don't remember which ones I uploaded already. So I have to go and check on my computer to go find out. Um, and then I will have to like get rid of because for some reason I have all the ones that I think I actually already uploaded still on my computer and I didn't get rid of them um or like the ones off of my desktop because normally I'll save them to my desktop to be uploaded um and so they're still all on my desktop and I was like I don't remember if I uploaded these or not so I probably need to go figure that out and then the one that I edited now I can upload for tomorrow because I thought they were good through like I had like uploading good through like this weekend or something so I need to check on that again but we got watched college football all day today, got NFL tomorrow all day, um, which is the Bears will be playing. So we'll have that game. I actually don't know the when they play. So that's why I need to figure out like, and that's why too, if I wake up late again, because I've been waking up kind of later, um, only because of, like I said, my stomach and like that one night where I literally could not sleep because of my stomach was just killing me. Um, and so I like woke up like three or four times or whatever it was in the middle of the night and it just completely threw me off and then I like haven't been sleeping like I've been going to bed kind of later because I've been sleeping so late during the day and so like I'm not tired early like right now it's like almost 11 o'clock which isn't really late but most likely I'll get in bed I probably won't fall asleep right away because I'm not tired enough because I woke up today at like 10 o'clock and so um yeah <laughs> but uh my sleeping has been like my sleep schedule has been really off and stuff like that this week so 
hopefully want to try and get back into it like maybe next week I'll try and take melatonin because I really don't want to get out of like a good sleep schedule but the only problem is sometimes when I take the melatonin is that it makes me sleep longer like I'm more like inclined to sleep later than two sometimes when I take it so um, I don't want that to happen but I'd like to be able to fall asleep early so that I can wake up um, early because I'm not in that routine right now and as soon as I get out of a routine like that it is like impossible for me to try and get back into um even if like jack comes and wakes me up in the morning like when he was for school um or my alarms go off like sometimes i just cannot wake up and i'll just sleep right through them which is really bad um but that's another reason too i was like if i wake up late though tomorrow i don't want to end up missing the bears game or you know because we have to go to all the grocery stores and stuff like that and i don't like going to the grocery stores late either so that's why i was like maybe if i can try and get back on a good sleep schedule this week it'd work out better but I think though they're in Denver so I think they might be playing the later game like the three o'clock game or something like that like the afternoon football um like our time because for their time it would be like a noon game um you know something like that like it might be like a two o'clock or something like that for us but it would be like more of a noon game for them which is why it's always weird because whenever we play like somewhere that's in a different time zone normally it ends up being actually a later game um for us like you know because we're our our time i think they try and do it so that it like meets more in the middle so like you might end up having a little bit of a later game but it's not so late that like the other team is super early for the other team if that makes sense that's why i kind of noticed last year it's things for people that are like on the west coast because like sunday night football has to be like really late like a really no it's really early i'm sorry i was thinking about that during the super bowl because i think when the super bowl comes on it's like only like i think would be like three o'clock like if you were like living in like the west coast um which is like really weird because i'm like normally like for us it's like dark like during most of the football game um like almost when it starts like the sun starts setting you know when it's january Fe february it's in february um and so like that's why i was like it's really weird like you know that like for them it's like a different time like i don't know why i've never wrapped my brain around that but it's the same thing too for like football if we're playing somewhere else um you know that's at home or two if they're compensating for like you know if we were playing somebody that wasn't in our time zone they might then end up making it like a later time to compensate for them being able to watch it in a different you know their fans i guess in a different time zone um which like i said i'm gonna actually pay attention to that more i think this year and try and see like oh is that actually true because i kind of started noticing it last year i was like whenever we're playing this team it tends like seems like we're like have a later time start time so it might be like a two or three o'clock instead of being like a noon which is a lot of times when we end up playing um which would be nice but i don't know for sure I can probably just check on my ESPN app before I go to sleep, but um, that's another reason why I was like, you know what, let's just scratch going to the other grocery stores because I just didn't feel like making my list either. And I was like, I'd rather edit honestly today than make my grocery list. I don't know why. I just, I sat down twice, tried to do it, and I was like, I don't feel like doing this. So I was like, I'd rather do something else. So I actually did something else that was productive, but you know, whatever. <laughs> so see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow so bye guys